tutorial number this is another discord tutorial creation series welcome back to the series i haven't done one of these in a while so today is about reaction roles so reaction roles are like a good way for people to like sign up for role pings or um another cool way so i'm gonna show you how to make those today so what you're gonna do is the reason we're looking at my web browser is because we're gonna have to add a bot so go to this website I'll link I'll have it down in my video description I'll have this website in the video description once you're here go to invite actually go to manage find the server that you want to add it to you want to add it to this one then click continue give them all these permissions you don't have to give them administrator if you don't want to and he's in the server now so now we're gonna create another channel and I'll show you the discord but before I do let me just get out of this direct message Okay, the cool circuit is streaming in there. So, um, Discord, window capture. Of course, they're not seeing anything, so let me flip it. Discord, done. Transition. So what we're going to do is we're going to clone one of these channels. I'm going to clone the rules channel by right clicking and clone channel. And then you're going to type in the name. I'm going to say, I'm going to say notification sign up and hit enter. There you go. Now we're going to type it up. But first what we're going to do is I'm going to type in this. And I'm going to put in some emojis. I want general emojis. I'm going to... Like I'm going to put here, camera. Mighty uploads. Then a white check mark. Announcements. Enter. Now we have to create reaction roles. So go to settings, roles, and I'm going to title this um, announcements. I'm going to make it dark green. Go down here to clear role permissions and enable this one here. And before you click save changes, create the video announcements role or the YouTube video role. Then click save changes once it's done. Now what we're gonna do is in order for this to work correctly, you need to have developer mode enabled to enable developer mode go to your user settings and then go, hold on I'm gonna need to disable streamer mode and then go here and then go to appearance and then scroll down to this switch here developer mode then keep make sure this is on. Then what we need to do is go to the three dots here, copy ID. Now we're going to go back to the web browser. Here we are back on the web browser. What we're going to want to do is go to reaction roles. So once you copy that raw ID, 
what you're gonna do is click on create new reaction role and then you're gonna change this to use ID and then that message ID that I showed you earlier why you need the developer mode paste that there and then go to notification sign up or whatever your role ping channel is called I'm gonna get that um, camera uh, camera and then go to select option YT notifications and then go to the check mark then announcements the roles the um, emojis don't have to be the same and once this is done click create and now we go back to our discord server Let me go back to our Discord server, and you can see Carlbot has added the reactions. And if I click on this emoji, it will give me the YT notifications role. If I click this emoji, it will give me server announcements. And then if I deselect one of them, it will remove that role from you. And then if I deselect this one, it will remove that. It will remove the announcements role from me. Simple as that. Anyway, I hope you found this tutorial helpful. If you did, please consider leaving a comment down below and tell me. And if you need any help with anything, let me know in the comments or on my social media pages. And I will be more than happy to respond. Anyway, see you guys in the next video. Bye.